In today's episode of the story of animals, we dive into the murky waters of the Amazon and Orinoco River basins in South America, where a truly shocking creature lurks, literally. Meet an animal that defies expectations with its ability to generate powerful bursts of electricity. But how does it do this and why? Let's unravel the mysteries of the electric eel. Despite its name, the electric eel is not actually an eel. It belongs to the knife fish family, a group of freshwater fish native to South America. Unlike true eels, which have elongated dorsal fins, the electric eel propels itself using an undulating anal fin that runs along the length of its body. This fish can grow up to 8 feet long and weigh over 40 pounds, making it one of the largest knife fish in the world. What sets the electric eel apart from other creatures is its ability to generate and control electricity. This astonishing ability comes from three specialized organs. The main organ, hunter's organ, and sac's organ. Together, these organs contain thousands of modified muscle cells called electrocytes, which work like tiny batteries storing and releasing electrical energy. When the eel wants to deliver a shock, it sends a signal from its nervous system to these electrocytes, triggering a sudden discharge of electricity. This process creates an electric field that can be used for navigation, communication and, most famously, hunting and self-defense. The strongest recorded shock from an electric eel reaches an incredible 860 volts, enough to stun a large predator or even knock a human unconscious. The electric eel is an apex predator in its environment, and its hunting strategy is as dramatic as its name suggests. Using low-voltage pulses, it scans its surroundings detecting movements in the murky waters. Once it locates its prey, often small fish, amphibians, or even birds, it delivers a high-voltage shock, immobilizing the unfortunate victim almost instantly. Interestingly, electric eels don't always rely on a single shock. If a prey item is still moving, the eel may deliver multiple pulses to ensure it is completely incapacitated. Afterward, it swallows its meal whole, using suction to draw the food into its mouth. Electric eels inhabit slow-moving, oxygen-poor waters, where most fish would struggle to survive. To cope with these conditions, they have evolved an unusual adaptation. They breathe air. Unlike most fish, which rely solely on gills, electric eels surface every few minutes to gulp air, absorbing oxygen through the lining of their mouth. This ability allows them to thrive in stagnant waters where oxygen levels are too low for other fish. However, it also means that if an electric eel is prevented from reaching the surface, it can drown, even in water. Beyond hunting, electric eels use low-voltage electric pulses to communicate. Scientists have observed that these pulses vary in frequency and intensity, allowing eels to recognize each other, establish territory, and even engage in courtship behaviors. Some researchers believe these pulses may also play a role in distinguishing individuals, much like a unique signature. An electric eel's ability 
to generate high voltage discharges makes it one of the most formidable creatures in its ecosystem. When threatened by predators such as caimans or large fish, the eel can unleash powerful shocks to deter an attack. During the dry season, when water levels drop, electric eels begin their breeding season. Males construct foam nests, yes, nests made from their own saliva, where females lay eggs. A single nest can contain up to 17,000 eggs, ensuring that at least some offspring survive the perilous environment. The young eels, or larvae, hatch fully dependent on their yolk sacs for nourishment. As they grow, they gradually develop their electrical abilities, starting with weak pulses before eventually generating the powerful shocks of an adult. Electric eels have fascinated scientists for centuries. In the 18th century, explorers like Alexander von Humboldt documented their shocking abilities. Today, researchers study electric eels to better understand bioelectricity, a field that has influenced the development of medical devices like pacemakers. Recent studies have even explored how electric eels regulate their voltage output, which could inspire new battery technologies. This incredible creature, once feared and misunderstood, is now contributing to scientific advancements in ways we never imagined. The electric eel is a true marvel of evolution, combining power, intelligence, and resilience. From its unique hunting methods to its role in scientific discovery, this remarkable fish continues to captivate and inspire. So, the next time you hear about an animal with shocking abilities, remember, nothing does it quite like the electric eel. Now, it's time to see how much you've learned from today's episode. We've got three fun trivia questions coming up. Ready? Let's start. Question one. What part of an electric eel's body is responsible for generating electricity? The correct answer is B. It's specialized organs. Electric eels generate electricity using three special organs. The main organ, hunter's organ, and sac's organ, which contain thousands of electrocytes that store and release electrical energy. Let's try another question. Question two. How does an electric eel breathe? The correct answer is C, by surfacing and breathing air. Unlike most fish, electric eels need to surface every few minutes to gulp air, absorbing oxygen through the lining of their mouth. This adaptation allows them to survive in oxygen-poor waters. Let's move on to the last question for this episode. Question 3. Why do electric eels release high-voltage shocks? The correct answer is A. To stun prey and defend against predators. Electric eels use powerful electric shocks to incapacitate prey and protect themselves from potential threats, making them one of the most unique hunters in the animal kingdom. Great job if you got all three questions correct. If you missed any, don't worry. You've just learned some fascinating facts about one of nature's most electrifying creatures. Thank you for watching. 
If you have suggestions for our next video, feel free to share them in the comments below. We'll be sure to give you an acknowledgement for your contribution.